Perfect. Perfect. Go ahead, do your walk around. Make sure you got enough clearance over here. Make sure you got enough clearance over here for when your trailer swing out. By you walking around this way, you should know which which uh, hole you're going to go into. With the third one? Second one? Make it happen. What's up, y'all? Let me wipe my screen. Y'all know what it is. It's your boy Redline back with another video. This is my second student. Uh, I've been guiding him back, but he want to try to back by himself. So this is going to be his first time backing into a spot. So let's see what he can do. Said he was going into the second hole, but it looks like he's going to be end up backing into the third hole. Second student, Andre, representing Detroit, Michigan, for Stevens Transport. So instead of the second hole, he got in the third hole, but guess what I'm gonna do? We ain't got number time and opportunity out here, so little do he know he's about to redo this because he said he was going in the second hole. So whatever hole you tell me you're going in, you're gonna put the truck in that hole. Right there, right there, right there. This ain't the second hole, bro. So guess what you get to do? Swing around and put it in the second hole. So when you guys get on my truck, yes, I do let you guys practice your backs uh, when we got open parking lots. So you see we got all these open spots over here. So I'm letting them play around with uh, his setup. Hopefully he can catch a setup and uh, by the time he finish and get back on the yard for uh, his grad class, he'll be ready to go on his own. My uh, Trey, my previous student that you all met uh, on my channel, he's already in, been in grad class. He's graduated from grad class and he has his own truck now. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get him together before I go home. So we're gonna see if he can get it in the second spot and I'm gonna catch up with y'all in a second. So you know, one thing I'm gonna tell you, you see how your truck is pointing this way? You see how you this way? Your truck's supposed to be this way. You need to be, your truck, all, your tractor always be straight for when you back up, right? Cause we gotta swing it that way. So once you make your heart, your heart right, then you start coming left, the swinger back, you always come straight. You don't turn all the way the opposite direction. So let's go ahead through the walk around. See, you got all this real estate over here. By the time your tractor swing out, we got more than enough real estate. The closest tractor you're gonna be getting to is that gray one right there. So what we're gonna do, I'm not I'm, I'm gonna let you do it again. We go in that second hole, right? Yeah. You represent Detroit. Hey y'all, this 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 Detroit right here. So we we gonna we're gonna see what Detroit got the off out here. He said the second hole, the second hole right here. Now let's let, let's get it popping, Detroit. Here we go. 
We ain't got nothing but time and opportunity. You know, uh, we early. We are we could be there today. This load that we got right now is a McDonald's load. It's going to uh, Long Beach, California. And it don't drop off until 5.30 in the afternoon tomorrow. Right now it's about about noon. Uh, we're at the border. We're in Arizona. At the border of Arizona and California. So here he goes. Start getting underneath there. All the way, all the way. Why are you turning that way? Here we go. Go up that way. Why are you doing that? Straight line back. Straight back. There you go. Keep the wheel like that. There you go. Go back that way. Keep her going. Got her in the second hole. One more time. All right, Corey, get out the guys. Set her on one. If you can't slow this truck down, we taking that ramp. And that's a ramp that you don't want to take. Gotcha. Don't worry about people flying down. This is a steep ass hill. Gotcha. So we're gonna we're gonna get you down. Put her on two. You go down whenever you get them little indicators, brake checks, and everything. Don't try to be the don't worry about being the fastest down the mountain. The objective is to make get them safety. make it make it down the mountain. We're not in no rush. Anybody behind us, they see we got our mercies on, they can go around. You said we went down to six percent, ain't look like this though. <laughs> go ahead, put her on two.
object, another object of why we going slow. You got full control of the truck. So if something was to happen, you got more than enough control of this vehicle to hit the shoulder or whatever to have an escape to avoid any kind of accident. Loose gravel, some of them be a lot of sand, yeah. some of them be like straight the dirt. Put her on three. Drop her in one.
put a weight station. And once we get up to about 37, we'll drop her back in the two. But who would really put a weight station like on a hill? Sure. Like, who was thinking about that right now? The law man. But yeah, we'll pull them right here as they're coming down the hill. That one majority of the time be closed. Majority of the time I come down here is closed. I think I've probably seen that way station open probably one time. So don't get her up too fast. We still gotta go all the way down that hill, then swerve back to the left. Yep, this is what mountain driving is like. Majority of the time is slowing the truck down, coasting. On top of reserving fuel. Go ahead, give her a little gas. The bad part is I still can't go over 46. Like I said, you can give her a little gas from there. Key it in. Once uh -huh. we get to the bottom, I key it in. I type it in. Maintain about 37, 38. We can do that for a little bit. So we got we going down downhill once we cross this little crevice right Valley. there. Yeah.